Well, several people suffered firework-related injuries during the New Year's Eve celebrations, and Honolulu EMS responded to reports of eye injuries, serious burns, and more. Our Shanila Kabir follows up on the New Year's Eve emergency runs. New Year's was a very fun and festive night for many people, but there were accidents. And officials say this is not the way they wanted to start the new year. EMS says it responded to eight fireworks-related injuries. Six of the eight are permanently disfiguring accidents, including loss of limbs and eyesight. The fireworks-related accident victims varied in age, some as young as six years old and some kapuna. Sadly, this year it included three children. Um, some of the folks that I encountered over the night, either at the scene or at the hospital, um, some of them were a little elusive and, and, and weren't as forthcoming about exactly what happened because maybe they didn't want to get in trouble or they were ashamed. Um, but all of them, I think, realized um, the devastating natures of their injuries. And officials say it was a busy night, not just for fireworks, but assaults and many traffic accidents. There were more than 20 fires caused by fireworks. Honolulu Fire Department identified some high-risk areas and state DOT has been clearing those areas and they said because of, of that work, that fire did not spread. It was only about a 100 by 100 area. Um, another brush fire um, that wasn't fireworks related, the same thing was reported um, where it wasn't, it didn't spread because of the work by the DOT. First responders suspect many more injuries took place, but residents were hesitant to call 911. Honolulu's emergency person personnel see the injuries fireworks can cause firsthand, and they urge everyone to ditch illegal fireworks in 2024. Shanila Kabir, Island News.